Ladies and gentlemen, Silent Mike back with another video back at Occam Strength, Sacramento, California. Hitting some squats, talking some mess as I normally do. I appreciate all the support on the recent weightlifting videos. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you do enjoy it, be sure to turn on notifications. We got a little voiceover just letting you know what's happening. Uh, lately with my squats, I've been trying to go three four maybe even five times a week kind of depending on how my legs and energy systems is feeling uh, i just kind of take my frequency day to day uh, wake up in the morning seeing how i feel uh, i typically try to go two to three light days uh, and light for me would mean i would do a pause or potentially go beltless to lower the overall load uh, and stimulus i'm throwing at myself um, and then from there uh, I typically try to get two or three heavier days. One day is maybe a single or double. Another day is maybe uh, triples or fives uh, with a belt on. I start every single workout with some kind of squat. My back's feeling really good. My legs are feeling really strong. Uh, and as you guys shall see coming up here, and if you follow me on Instagram, Sal Michael Two Ks, you noticed I did hop back into deadlifts, uh, which is the topic of the day. And the most common question I have received is, Mike, does squatting help the deadlift, Mike? How did you take a year off of deadlifts, basically? Because I competed in June uh, 2018 in deadlift competition. Didn't go quite as planned. Um, and then recently, I just pulled a big double, which you guys will see in an upcoming video. I don't want to give any spoilers, but if you guys stay tuned, you'll see it. Uh, and the question is, um, you know, I, the answer is, I guess, uh, yes and no. Uh, the main reason that I can take a year off deadlifts uh, and come back and smash a pretty okay weight, uh, which for me, you know, was maybe, you know, 75, 80% of my best ever, um, is because I have deadlifted one to three times a week for 10 to 12 years straight. Um, you know, is it as good as I've always been? No. On top of that, I've also worked on my leg strength. I've done tons of lunges, tons of Bulgarian split squats, a good amount of squats over the last couple months, um, and then a ton of upper back work, chin ups, rows. Uh, pull-ups, pull-downs, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So the musculature, although the motor pattern isn't perfect, my musculature and strength in general uh, is still pretty decent. Here we are with maybe uh, 400, I don't know, 74 pounds or so, moving pretty fast. And then uh, again, just a moderate single is probably again a quote-unquote lighter day. Just wanted to not get as much volume, um, warming up the wrist to get into some cleans. Look at that camera detail. You guys can actually see how ugly I am. I apologize for that. Really, really good personality. I like to think I have a decent brain. Not the best to look at, and I apologize. The one and only Alan Troll, uh, my boy Marcus, um, a bunch of different people have been having a lot of fun coming to train with us uh, a couple times a week. Actually moving okay right there, considering how uh, bad my wrist feels. I jammed it really hard on a power clean like three, four weeks ago, and it just hasn't got better. And at least one clean during the session always jacks it back up. But uh, I'm doing my best to really focus on the overhead work cleaning and snatching multiple times a week trying to get into rhythm just to have fun really you know will i compete in it i don't know but uh i am feeling good back feels good legs feel good brain feels good i'm having a lot of fun training with the guys so that's why we're pushing the deadlift and the squat again um i think a big deadlift is on the horizon big squats have already been smashed another big pr is coming in an upcoming video uh i hit a, a big comeback triple uh, at some pretty decent weight and my body weight's staying. I haven't really weighed myself, but I imagine I'm about 205, 208 pounds or so feeling fairly lean. I'm riding my bike everywhere. Shout out to summertime. Uh, and it's a lot of fun. So, uh, right here, two greens. I don't know what that is. It's probably about a hundred kilos. Um, these boys are snatching, but I wasn't snatching at this point. I literally just started snatching about two weeks ago. And this video is about two and a half weeks ago. So you guys will see a bunch of snatch work coming up. Nothing impressive as I lack the overhead mobility but i really am working on a power snatch going to try to snatch something at least fairly fairly mediocre over the next couple months as well as my clean continue to push it training frequency against is very high in the main lifts uh very low volume i'm um, working out with higher intensities and going by feel but uh i'm really enjoying it and uh, my deadlifts again conventional deadlifts we're going at it Yes, I'm using straps. I don't really care. I've talked to you guys so many times about how I, I don't lift to compete, man. I lift to train. I lift to uh, feel good. I lift to have fun. This is an outlet for me. It's something I truly enjoy. Uh, and I have an extra fun right now with the boys training. You know, the, the environment that, that we've put together here, even though it's, um, you know, only four or five guys weekly and none of us are at our peak. Uh, a lot of us are 
a uh, little banged up. Ben hurt his back, I think, earlier this year. Marcus has a hamstring issue. Allen's in daddy mode. You know, the guy's probably getting no sleep, stressed out of his mind. Um, but all of this is just about the community and the culture. Guys coming together. Ladies coming together. I say guys very loosely. Uh, just having a really good time. Smashing some weights, staying healthy, and really being encouraging uh, for everybody. Uh, there's a scarcity mindset that's set in our world right now. Um, small communities, big communities, politics, business, especially you know YouTube, fitness. You start to dig into those things. That just is is absolutely false. There's 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 enough weights for all of us to lift. Someone who lifts weights doesn't make them a better human than someone who doesn't lift weights or lift more weights. Um, and so to have these guys around in a positive environment, building a culture that I truly enjoy. Uh, uh, that I'm having fun with getting healthier and doing a pastime that I love uh, has been great. So hopefully you guys enjoy these videos. More raw training coming. Be sure to subscribe. Turn on notifications. Silent Mike. I'm out of here. Thank you guys so much for the constant support. Stay updated. Instagram, Twitter, Silent Mike with two Ks. Bye.